The impression the city leaves usually comes from its famous landmarks. For the city of Xi'an, one of the must-see landmarks is the Big Wild Goose Pagoda. It's China's oldest and best-preserved Tang Dynasty Pagoda. What's up, it's Jeffrey and we are standing at Xuanzang Square. Now Xuanzang, where does the name come from? It comes from the guy standing here right behind me. He is one of the most famous monks in ancient China. And he went to India, came back after 17 years and brought all kinds of knowledge of Buddhism with him. And all that knowledge was stored right there in that tower, the big wild goose pagoda. Let's check it out. After entering the gate of the pagoda, you will pass the Tsun Temple. This temple was built in 648 AD by Emperor Liu Zhi to commemorate his deceased mother. Every nook and cranny was meant to mimic his mother's beauty. Four years later, Xuanzang was named head monk of the temple and then started the construction of the Big Wild Goose Pagoda. Big Wild Goose Pagoda consists of seven levels and on every level you can find some Buddhist scriptures, paintings and statues and that is also what makes it into this tourist attraction. People come from all over China and the world just to see this beautiful tower. If you want to escape the big crowds, you can find the Tangsun side park to the east of the pagoda to enjoy a quiet walk. If you are into selfies, you are sure to find some cool spots no one has ever photographed before. After achieving a zen-like state by walking through the small park, it is time to walk over the boulevard, past some small shops in search for some quirky Chinese souvenirs, and prepare yourself for the biggest attraction at the Big Wild Goose Pagoda, the Fountain Water and Light Show. It is one of the biggest fountain water shows in Asia. On weekdays, performances are held at noon and at 8 p.m. On official holidays and weekends, Shows are held at noon, 2 p.m., 4 p.m., 6 p.m., and the last one at 8. But better get there early if you want to secure a nice spot. 